places like that, so they installed one. Pretty cool. Hi, Alan. Shabbat Shalom. Nice to see you. Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Shabbat Shalom. It is lovely to welcome you here to Temple Shittik. For those of you who are here with us under the canopy in this beautiful, humid, hot night, and those who are watching via the live stream, we're delighted you've chosen to spend your Shabbat with us. This Shabbat comes as this opportunity to take a moment to pause, to enter into this space, and to let go of the week that has been. Whatever the stresses, the pressures, the work, Shabbat comes as an opportunity to really let it go, to take a deep breath, to enter into the space, and to breathe. And so we always begin by taking a neshima amulka, by taking a deep breath. And so we breathe in, letting go of the week, and we breathe out. And we breathe in again, entering into this space, and we breathe out. And it's my pleasure this evening to be leading with Jay-Z. This is our annual service where we bless the participants in the Pan Mass Challenge, which is a big thing for our community and many of our congregations. So we'll be doing that a little later in the service. And so we bring Jay-Z along because Jay-Z is one of the riders in the Pan Mass Challenge, as well as being a wonderful song leader for our community. <laughs> and so we turn together to page 24 as we prepare to welcome the Shabbat angels into the space with the words of Shalom Aleichem. So this is a little bit different version of Shalom Aleichem that you might be used to. It's a, this is something called a mashup, where you take the traditional words and you mash them up with contemporary lyrics. And Those of you who are familiar with the movie Pay It Forward might have heard this song before. Some of you who are familiar with the band Train might have heard this before. Anyway, you'll get the hang of it. It's got a kind of a cool message and it's a great little mashup. Hope you enjoy it. Shalom Aleichem, Malachi Asharit, Malachi Elyon, Mi Melech Malachi Hamlachim, Hakadosh Baruch Hu. Let's try that together. Shalom Aleichem, Shalom Aleichem, Malachi Asharit, Malachi Elyon, Mi Melech Malachi Hamlachim, Hakadosh Baruch Hu. One more time. Shalom Aleichem, Malachi Asharit. Malachi el yom, mi melech malachi hamlachim, hakadosh baruch hu. All right, switch to contemporary. I need a sign to let me know you're here. 
Cause all of these lines are being drawn out in the atmosphere I need to know that things are gonna look up Cause I feel us drowning in a sea spilled from a cup And there is no safe place and no place safe to lay my head You can feel the world shake with the words that are said And I'm, I'm calling all you angels And I'm, I'm calling all you angels and I won't give up if you don't give up I won't give up if you don't give up I won't give up if you don't give up I won't give up if you don't give up Cause I need a sign to let me know you're here Cause my TV set just keeps it all from being clear I need a reason for the way things have to be I need a hand to help build up some kind of hope inside of me Cause I'm calling all you angels Cause I'm, I'm calling all you angels When children have to wonder if their parents are still here and People have to sleep outside Cause their homes have disappeared The only hope we have at night Is to pray to God with all our might And to cling to one another As the angels of the world unite Shalom Aleichem Malachi Asharit Malachi El Yom Mi Melech Malachi Hamlachim Hakadosh Baruch Hu Sing it with me Shalom Aleichem Malachi Asharit Malachi El Yom Mi Melech Malachi Hamlachim Hakadosh One more time Shalom Aleichem Malachi Asharit Malachi El Yom Mi Melech Malachi Hamlachim Hakadosh Baruch Hu Shalom Aleichem Malachi Asharit Malachi El Yom Mi Melech Malachi Hamlachim Hakadosh Baruch Hu Having called the angels into our presence, we turn back in our Siddurim to page two for the lighting of the Shabbat candles. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech Achim Asher Kidshanu Vimitzvotav Vitzivanu Lechad Likner Lechad Likner Shel Shabbat. Amen. One of the key themes of Shabbat is that idea of welcoming people in to join us in our space. And so, having welcomed the Shabbat angels, we now welcome the Shabbat bride by turning to Lachadodi on page 20 and 21. And together we'll sing the first, second, fifth, eighth, and ninth verses of the song. And when we get to that final verse, we'll rise together as a community as we're able, facing towards the door to welcome the Shabbat bride, Lachadodi, on page 20. Ya la 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 Lachadodi, ya la 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 Likrat Kala, ya la 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 Pnei Shabbat, Pnei Shabbat. Lekabe, 
We rise in body or in spirit facing towards the entrance. Oi ve shalom ateret bala gambe simcha uvet sohola tochemune am segula boi chala boi chala lecha dodi Likrat kala pene Shabbat nekabela lecha dodi likrat kala pene Shabbat nekabela. Verse twenty two. Page 22, not verse 22. Page 22, 11 lines down. Magad luma asechaya. And we begin with the words, Hallelujah. 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 Magad luma asechaya. Hallelujah. 
במחשבותיך. הללויה, הללויה, מה גרלו, מה עשיך היה. מעולם במחשבותיך. Lai, 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 Ma garlu, ma secha ya. Me uram khu makshevo techa. Ma garlu, ma secha ya. Having welcomed the Shabbat bride, we take a moment now to welcome one another. So turn to find someone else under the canopy. Say hello, introduce yourself, just wish him a Shabbat Shalom. If you're at home with people, maybe give them a hug, the people in your room, send them a message. Say hello, um, send a text message to people you wish you could be spending Shabbat with, all the different people. Okay, and so now we turn in our Siddurim, as I have to be the bad guy interrupting the conversations, to page 26, and we continue now together with the Chatsi Kaddish. <clears throat> Yitgadal ve yitgadash shmei rabba. Amen. Yamadi rachi rutev yamlich machute. Bechaye chon uv yom e chon. Uv chaye dechol beit Yisrael. Bagala, bagala. Uv izman kari ve imeru. Amen. Yehe shmei rabba mevorach. Leolam ulal me almaya. Yitbarach, Yitbarach, for Yishtabach, for Yitbar, for Yit Roman, for Yit Nase, for Yit Adar, for Yit Ale, for Yit Alal, Shemed Kudashah, Brichu, Brichu, Leila, Min Kol Birchata, Vashirata, Tush Bechata, Venechemata, Damiran Bealma, Vimeru, Amen. Turning to page 28, it's worth noting that in our tradition, our call to prayer comes at this point in the service. We've been doing something up to this moment that seemed like praying, it felt like praying, but the call to prayer only comes now. And that's in contrast with other religious traditions where the church bells or the muezin are bringing people to prayer, calling them before the prayer begins. And we might think about what that's like. Is this our warm-up? We're getting ready, exercising our spiritual muscles in the lead-up to this moment. Or is it just an acknowledgement that we Jews are not the most timely people always, and so it was better to call us to prayer a little bit into the service to give everyone an opportunity to be here. But the important thing with the Baruch Hu is the statement of a minion. We wait till this point in the service, I think, because we know that we don't want to pray alone. We know that praying in community is that much more powerful. And so we call ourselves to prayer after we've been praying a little bit in the intention and the hope of being in the community. And so for all of us who make up this minion, both digital and in person, we now rise in body or in spirit, facing towards the east, which is that way, for the Baruch Hu, our call to prayer amidst the prayers. Yalla lai lai lai, yalla lai lai lai, yalla lai lai lai, yalla lai lai lai. Am I awake? Am I prepared? Are you listening to my prayer? Can you hear my voice? Can you understand? Am I awake? Am I prepared? 
Baruch Hu et Adonai HaMevorah Baruch Adonai HaMevorah Le'olam ba'eh Le'olam ba'eh Yalla lai 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 Yalla lai 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 Yalla lai 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 Yalla lai 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 If you'll please be seated. We continue together on the top of page 31 in the English. Praise to you, Adonai, our God, from whom the evening flows. Your wisdom sets the way on which time and season glide. Your breath guides the sail of the stars, creator of the tide of time and light. You guide the current of day into night. As heaven spans to infinity, you set its course for eternity. Praise to you, Adonai, our God, from whom the evening flows. Baruch atah Adonai hama'ariv aravim And on the next page we read together of God's love for Israel. Ahavat olam beit Yisrael amcha ahavta Torah umitzvot chukim umishpatim otanu limadata al ken Adonai eloheinu b'shoch beinu uvkumeinu nasiach b'chukecha v'nismach b'divrei Toratecha uvmitzvotecha le'olam ba'ed Ki hem chayenu ve'orech yamenu, uvahem negei yomam v'layla, v'avtecha al tasir mimenu le'olamim. Baruch atah Adonai, ohev amo Yisrael. Shema Yisrael. Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad. Baruch Shem, Kevod Malchuto, Le'olam Va'et. Ve'ahavta et Adonai Elohecha, Bechol Levavcha, Bechol Nafshecha, Ubechol Meodecha. Vehayu advarim ha'ele asher anochi mitzavecha hayom halvavecha v'shinan tam levanecha v'dibarta abam v'shivtecha v'veitecha uvlechtecha v'aderech uvshoch becha uvkumecha uksar tam leot ayadecha. Ve'ayu l'totafot b'in e'necha U'chtav ta'am Al mezuzot b'itecha U'v'isharecha L'man t'izkeru V'asitem et kol mitzvotai V'item k'doshin l'Eloichem A'ani Adonai l'Eloichem Asher hotzeti etchem Me'eretz mitzrayim Liyot lachem lehohim, ani Adonai Eloheichem, Adonai Eloheichem, emet. On page 41 we read together, Sing the song of men and women joined in understanding and respect, the song of God's miracles, an earth protected and cherished, a gift for our children and the generations to come, the song of a land once ravished by war, now quiet and content, her soldiers home to leave no more. The song of a world redeemed. The song of peace. Micha Mocha on page 40. Micha Mocha Ba'elim Adonai מי כמוך נדר בקודש, מי כמוך באלים אדוני, מי כמוך נדר בקודש, נורא תהילות, 
ose ose pele no ra te ilot ose ose pele who is like you who is like you adonai who is like you adonai Moses and the children crossed the sea to sang to you with songs of joy. Who is like you, Adonai? Mi kamocha nelim Adonai. Mi kamocha ne dar bakode nora teilot. Oh, say, oh, say, fella, who is like you? Adonai, who is like you? Micha Mocha. When I have the privilege of leading with Jay Z, it's this point in the service, this bridge from Micha Mocha Tashkivenu, that's my favorite part of the service. The music that he sings elevates the words of the prayers. And it's a reminder of the fact that music has this immense power to lift our souls. It's no accident that the prayer we just sang was a song that our ancestors sang after crossing over the sea. And when we're coming to the evening and looking for comfort and support, what do we do? We sing again, singing the words of Hashkivenu as a prayer for the nighttime, looking for God to spread a shelter of peace over us, a canopy, if you will. And so as we join in with these words, Maybe at some point during the prayer, take a moment just to listen as well and to be uplifted and elevated and feel that sense of shalom, of peace and shleimut, of wholeness and the comfort that comes in the way that music only can. Hashki on page 42. Hashki Adonai Eloheinu l'shalom Hamideinu shomreinu l'chaim Hashkiveinu Hashkiveinu Adonai Eloheinu l'shalom Hamideinu Shomreinu lechayim. Spread the shelter of your peace over us. Guide us in wisdom, compassion, and trust. Ashki veinu Adonai, Eloheinu leshalom. Hamideinu shomreinu lechayim. Save us for the sake of your name. Shield us from hatred, sorrow, and pain. Hashkiveinu Adonai Eloheinu leshalom. Hamideinu shomreinu lechayim lechayim. We turn to page forty-six for the Amida, our standing prayer. We rise in body or in spirit, and we face towards the east for the words on page forty-six. Yalla la 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 Adonai 
Sit by Tai Tita, Ufi Yagi, Tehila Teha Adonai. Open up my lips that my mouth may declare your praise. Yai, lai, 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 lai. Yala, lai, lai, lai. Yala, lai, lai, lai. Yala, lai, lai, lai. Yai, lai, 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 lai. Yala, lai, lai, lai. Yala, lai, lai, lai. Yala, lai, lai, lai. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu velohe avotenu vimotenu, Elohe Abraham, Elohe Yitzchak, Elohe Yaakov, Elohe Sarah, Elohe Rivka, Elohe Rachel, Elohe Lea, Ha El Hagadol, Hagibor vehanora, El El Yon, Gomel Chasadim Tovim, Bekone Hakol. Vizoher has te avothim out, who may be gula leave nev nehem, lima an shemo biahava, Melecho zeru moshia huma again, Baruchata Adonai, Magen Abraham, Vizrat Sarah, Atagi bor leolam Adonai, Michae me tim ata rad lehoshia, Morid hatal. Michal Kel Chaim Bechesed, Michaye Metim Berachamim Rabim, So Mech Noflim Berofe Cholim, Umatir Asurim, Umekaye Memunato, Lishene Afar, Micha Mochabar Givurot, Umidome Lach. Melech me mi tu mechaye, u mats mi ach yeshua, neman atal chechayot me etim, baruch ata adonai, mechaye ha metim, ata kadosh vishim ha kadosh, udoshim bechol yom yaluch ha sela, baruch ata adonai, ha el ha kadosh. We continue silently now with our own private Amidah using the words of our hearts or the words of the page through until 62. Please feel free to be seated at the conclusion of your prayers. It was planted by my grandpa in his wisdom and his forethought to provide shade and protection for our family. As he finished with his toil, he looked up at me from the soil, and I never will forget the words he said to me. If you hold on tight to this tree of life, you will lead a life of justice and integrity. If you learn to see, it will set you free And the more you give, the more you will receive Hold on to the tree It's Chaim He I was on a search for knowledge As I headed off to college But my hopes of fame and fortune Were my fantasy I got caught up in the current 
Life was passing in a hurry And advice from long ago was just a memory If you hold on tight to this tree of life You will lead a life of justice and integrity If you learn to see, it will set you free And the more you give, the more you will receive Hold on to that tree It's Chaim He. When the phone rang that day, there was a voice from far away. It was a wake up call from home. So I drove 500 miles for a hug and one last smile. And I cried as he let go. If you hold on tight to this tree of life, you will lead a life of justice and integrity If you learn to see, it will set you free And the more you give, the more you will receive Hold on to the tree It's Chaim He Now the years flow by like water as I look upon my daughter and see my grandpa's image looking back at me I can almost hear his laughter coming through from ever after As I teach her of her fam family's famous legacy If you hold on tight to this tree of life You will lead a life of justice and integrity And if you learn to see will set you free and the more you give the more you will receive hold on to the tree it's high in he it's time for you and me to hold on to the tree it's high in he As we turn to page 253 in our Siddurim, we know that while Shabbat is a day of joy and celebration, there are those amongst us who are suffering, those in need of healing of the mind, body, soul, or spirit. And so even on a day of joy, we take a moment to pause, to reflect, and to offer a prayer for those who are in need of healing. This Shabbat, we pray for healing for Abba Noch Ben Yehudit, Elisa Dorfman, Avivia Sigalit Bat Devora. Barbara Lanzett, Barbara Ziman, David Feldman, Diane McCaslin, Dina Lutin, Devorah Bunye, Eleanor Lustig, Emma Held, Ethan Kadish, Yaiva Yaakob, Gemma Rose Nicoletti, Georgia, Elizabeth Hummel, Harav Nechama Bat Yaakov of Vernice, James Nicoletti, Jeremy Pivor, Jim Solomon, Joan Friedman Bat Cynthia, Joyce Pastor, Julian Arcee, Leah Bat Fagler, Lily Stander, Lisa Shapiro, Lynn Bauer, Mark Lampert, Mayor Abba Ben Ruven, Moishe Yol Ben Esther Avraham, Nachum Ben Razel, Nechama Bat Trainer Raziel, Noah Ayal Mibet, Yaakov Vasara, Pam Ross, Peter Gross, Robert Friedman, Romildo Sequeiro, Ron Abramson, Sam Goldenberg, Sarah Fager Bat Malka, Sarit Liat Bat Penina Sara, Stephen Rose, Susan Hoyer, Susan Scheller, Tara Sagor, Theodore Merkin, Tyson Bettinus, Wendy Gully, John Newmeyer, Joseph Ben Gittel, Catherine Giles, Jody Sandler, Lillian Shaw, Jacob Rosen, Bernice Slater, Norbert Grunfeld, Lynn Nathanson, and Sylvia Wolfson. If there are other names you're thinking of in need of healing, please share them now as I look around the room. Stephen Branfman, Joel Leutherstein, and Bella Dubois. We join together in offering this prayer for healing. Mishabirach avotenu mikor habracha le'imotenu 
May the source of strength who blessed the ones before us help us find the courage to make our lives a blessing and let us say Amen. Bless those in need of healing with refuah shalema, the renewal of body, the renewal of spirit. And let us say Amen. Amen. In this week's Torah portion, we are at the end of the book of Numbers, the book of Bamidbar. So we have a whole Torah book left to go, Devarim Deuteronomy. But the truth is that the Israelites' journey through the wilderness is at an end. Because the entire book of Deuteronomy takes place on the other side of the Jordan River with the people preparing to cross over and Moses delivering his final farewell speech. The wilderness years are coming to an end and that journey from Egypt to the promised land is also reaching its conclusion. So we're going to begin with some numbers. So how many years was the journey in the wilderness? 40 years. Okay, so that's the first number. Now, we're going to think about how far the Israelites must have journeyed in those 40 years. So let's say 365 days in a year, we lose 52 Shabbatot, because of course they wouldn't have walked on Shabbat. Let's say a few extra days, so let's go to 300 for a nice round number. So 300 days a year that they were walking, let's say a mile a day. Let's be really, really light on the Israelites. Just one mile. So, a mile a day, 300 days in the year for 40 years, how many miles did they walk? Mental arithmetic time. I'll be honest, I used my calculator before to check that I had the right answer, but 340, 300 times 40. That's the, that's the math. 12,000, bingo, so 12,000 miles is what we might imagine that the Israelites journeyed if they were walking one mile a day for 300 days for 40 years. Now, how many of you have looked at how big the Sinai Peninsula is for the Israelites to journey? It, it must be almost impossible to do 12,000 miles in the space of the Sinai Peninsula to get to the Promised Land, because actually Sinai is about 130 miles across or so, and 200 miles um, east-west 130, 200 miles northwest, north-south, so how you're getting to 12,000 miles is beyond me. So in all likelihood, either they were going in circle after circle after circle after circle to get there. There is, of course, the joke that Moses was leading the Israelites, and what do men not do? Ask for directions. So uh, we're stuck all the way through the wilderness to get there. But it's that journey. And we might wonder, so what's the significance of why 40 years? And why all that journey in the wilderness? And how far did they really travel? Because we know that actually 130 miles across, they probably could have done it pretty quickly. And so in many ways, I think for us, as we reflect on that journey in the wilderness, it's a reminder once again that the distance isn't that significant. What's important is journeying together. The Israelites had to all make that journey from Egypt, all had to reach the promised land. Only then could they enter. Everyone was needed. Everyone was necessary. That's one of the lessons. A second lesson might be about the fact that the length of time it takes to get somewhere is not as important as where you're traveling. We argue amongst ourselves, this route's better or that route's better, but really if we're all going to the same place, What's the difference at the end of the day? And the promised land in that way is our destination to which we're traveling. And the final lesson might be actually one about the fact that this is all just a story to give us the lesson of journeying towards a promised land and not actually as a physical place because how could that journey take 40 years but actually as a spiritual place 
as an ideal, as an aspiration, as something that we're striving towards, not necessarily a place that we're striving to be. And so when we reflect on our journey through the wilderness, we can see the significance of doing it together, of reaching that destination, and of actually the spiritual journey that we're embarking upon. And in many ways, that's a perfect lesson for the Pan Mass Challenge, the Pan Mass Ride that people are participating on. Some people will do 25 miles, I believe, on the first day, some 211 miles. The length is not the significant thing. Some people get to this destination, some people another destination, but again, the actual physical destination is not as significant as the ideal destination. The promised land, if you will, of the PMC, which is all about the work that is done and the money that is raised through this incredible endeavor for cancer research and to make a real difference in fighting this disease. And so when we think about our Pan Mass Challenge riders and the Israelites journeying in the wilderness, there are lots of nice parallels between them. Not least that I think there's an angle way you can cross the Sinai Desert that would be around 211 miles to really hit that PMC number exactly. But it's important to recognize as well for us that we as a community are grateful to all those people who endeavor and take part in this wonderful, wonderful local experience. It's a great cause, and I will say that a local doctor, a member of our community, actually reached out to me, not because they're participating in the PMC, but because they wanted to say how important they feel the PMC is for the research that they do in the area of challenging and fighting back against cancer. That's what these riders do, that's what these volunteers do, and that's why we as a community want to recognize them and offer them a blessing before they embark on this fantastic undertaking. And the other thing to remember when we think about this kind of physical exertion is that in our morning liturgy, we pray for our bodies first and our souls second because we recognize the significance of the bodies to achieve anything and then the souls accompanying the body on that journey. And so we know that there are a number of people participating in the Pan Mass Challenge. So if you're here and taking part or volunteering, please do step to the front. So Jay-Z, you can step in front and be one of the representatives. Jeffrey, if you come join us. And we also know that at home, we have various riders, David, Philip, Adam, Robin, Nancy, uh, Nancy is volunteering, Gary and Doug, who are all participating in the PMC, and I'm sure many others. And so on behalf of the community, as you prepare to take part in this wonderful, wonderful ride next weekend, we want to offer you this blessing. May the one who blessed our ancestors, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Sarah, Rebecca, Leah, and Rachel, Bless all of these cyclists. In the words of our liturgy, we give thanks to God for the health of their bodies. You have made each of us with wisdom. You have created the human body with veins, arteries, structures, and organs, each of which must function properly for our survival, allowing us to stand and run before you. In the words of Rabbi Judah ben Tema, may you be as bold as a leopard, as swift as an eagle, as fleet as a heart, and strong as a lion, to do the will of God who is in heaven and to complete this challenge before you. We pray that you will take inspiration from our ancestors who came before us. Like Joshua and Caleb, may you have the strength of dedication and commitment to complete a journey from the narrow place to your promised land. Like Nachshon ben Aminadav, may you have the courage and fortitude to continue putting one pedal in front of the other, stepping forward with faith that you can complete the task. Like Samson, may you be imbued with strength, strength so that even when feeling adversity, the power within allows you to, come, to overcome all walls that stand before you. And like Miriam, may you feel the support of a community who stands together with you, supporting you with words and with song. We pray that the roads open up before you, that the support of your community inspires you, and that your bodies endure through the miles that are ahead. Baruch atah Adonai, rochfeh ol basah, umafli lasot, hamachazek otchem. We thank you, God, who heals all creatures and performs wonders and endows the human body with strength beyond our expectation. Venomar, and let us say, Amen. And so to the riders who are present, 
We're going to give you a copy of the prayer to take with you. Oh, awesome. you. And you. we have some prayer cards just with the English of the prayer because I don't know. I don't, I'm not a cyclist, so I don't know what you can actually fit in the cycling shorts or on the bike to carry with. But just a couple of copies of the prayer, just the English for yourself. And if there are friends who are riding, to give it to them as well so that they can join you on the ride. We wish you strength. And as we say at the end of each book of Torah, so this is why, again, this week is so appropriate. At the end of each book of Torah, we say, Chazak, Chazak, Venit Chazek. Be strong, be strong, and we will be strengthened through your endeavor, through your endeavor, and through all of yours endeavors. You are strong, you shall be strong, and together, through you, we will all be strengthened. So I just, just because I happen to have uh, the PMC jersey with me that, uh, that we're going to be riding in this year, I, I got mine early because uh, I'm doing a special ride, but Rabbi Danny, I, I will say that these fit very, very nicely in the back jersey pockets here. And, uh, Wonderful. As long so, as you put them inside of a baggie or something, you're, you're in good shape. So I hope they'll be handed out to many people on the ride ahead. So we wish you luck for that journey, and we look forward to hearing good reports in a couple of weeks' time. We will... We're giving you a pass next week for Friday night services. You have an exemption for not being here as you'll be riding, but the week after we expect to see you back and hear about the ride. So we now turn back to our Siddurim. We turn together to page 282. We rise in body or in spirit as we continue now with the words of Alenu. <clears throat> page 282. Alenu l'shabeach l'adon ha'kol l'atekedula l'yotzebreshit Shelo asanu kigoye haratzot, velo samanu kimishpochot haadama, shelo sam chelkenu kahem, vego ralenu kechol hamonam, vanachnu korim, umishtahabim umodim, lifne melech, malche hamlachim, hakadosh baruchu, letakeno lam bemalchut shadai, Venemar, Vehaya Adonai, Lemelech al Kola Aretz, Payom Hahu, Payom Hahu, Ye Adonai Echad, Ushemo, Ushemo, Ushemo Echad. As we turn to page 294 in our Siddurim, we never conclude a service without sacred memory. Remembering our loved ones who are no longer with us. This Shabbat, we remember the yard sites of Emily Bean, Lawrence <clears throat> Bean, Anna Berg, Gloria Cohen, George Fryer, Anne Hirsch, Gerald Matthew Levitt, Charles Levine, Deborah Rosenblatt, Samuel Sandler, Florence Sandorf, Aaron Sharfstein, Harry Soslow, Stephen Steingisser, Charlotte Lillian Woolbast. And during the month of Shloshim, we remember Andrew Hahn, the father of Gillian Cole, Doris D. Lurie, the mother of Roy Lurie, and Jack Price, the father of Michael Price. If there are other names you're remembering, please share them now as I look around the room. For all those we name out loud and for those we name in our hearts, we say together, Yit kadal vit kadash shemei rabba. Amen. Be'almadi v'rachi rutei v'amlich malchutei. B'chayechonu v'yomechonu v'chayei d'chol b'yit Yisrael. B'galau v'zman kariv v'imru. Amen. Yehei shmei rabba m'varach l'alam ulmei almaya. Yit barach v'yishtabach v'yit pa'a v'yit ramam v'yit naseh. V'yit ada v'yit alei v'yit alal. Shmei d'kudshah b'richu. L'eila min kol b'irchata v'shirata. Tush b'chata v'nechemata. Da miran ba alma ve imru amen. Yehe shlama rabba min shamaya. Vachayim aleinu ve al kol Israel ve imru amen. O se shalom bim ramav. Hu ya se shalom aleinu ve al kol Israel ve imru amen. Zichronam livracha. May their memories always be for a blessing. And let us say amen. So as we take a seat, one of the traditions on Shabbat is to offer the priestly blessing. And so we're going to do that now, and we will then pass out the, the grape juice and the wine. Thank you, Karen. You're perfect. So we'll do the priestly blessing. And anyone can receive a blessing. No one's too old. So I'm going to ask, if you're sitting near people, place your hands. If it's comfortable, of course, just uh, personal space and all those things, but place your hands on the people who are around you to offer them the blessing, to share that blessing. Children can bless parents. Parents can bless children. Grandparents can bless children. Children can bless grandparents. Whichever direction the blessing is flowing in. 
But it's always a pleasure to be able to offer this priestly blessing and to share in this moment and to share these words, the most ancient blessing that our community has. Yivarechecha Adonai v'yishmerecha May God bless you and keep you. Yair Adonai panah v'elecha v'yichunecha May God's light shine upon you and may God be gracious to you. Yisa Adonai panah v'elecha v'yasem lecha Shalom. Shalom. And may God lift up God's face to you, look upon you, and this day and every day give you the blessing of peace. And together let us say, Amen. Amen. So as we turn to Kiddush, just a few announcements to mention. Um, we had a great barbecue last week, last Friday night. It was a wonderful event. And we have another one on August 19th. So if you would like to join us for that barbecue, we'll be hopefully outside for services. We'll have the guy who's grilling over there and the food coming over and everything taking place. It was a wonderful potluck experience and we had lots of fun with all the families who are present. So uh, please do sign up and uh, join us because it was a lot of fun. And this week, beginning at the beginning of August, on Wednesdays in August at 9.30, we're offering programming for our Yeladim, for our zero to five children. So if you have those children, if you know of those children, let them know. We have an art session with Alison, um, no, an art session with Stephanie, a story session with Alison, a song session with Hollis, and a playground session with myself. So that's happening each one of the Wednesdays. Um, so we hope you'll join us for that. Lots happening. Check the website for all the details about everything else that's taking place. Thank you to Jay-Z for his beautiful music this evening. Thank you to John for the technology. That means that we're heard and seen. And uh, thank you, Karen, for passing out the grape Thanks, juice man. and the wine. And so um, do, do my youngest two members want to come up to help, me, help us with Kiddush? Do you guys want to come up? Do you want to come up? One of you can come up to hold the grape juice. One of you can come up to hold the wine. The, the, oh, you, can you hold the can you hold the challah? Yeah. No, I no. Oh, can you hold it <laughs> in the bag? Okay. Ah. So if you come, so us, why don't you hold that and we'll hold this together. Can we hold the bottom? Is that? Yeah. Okay. So do you want to help me hold this? <clears throat> there we go. And so we face out towards the community. Cool. As Jay Z leads us in the kiddush. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam Borei Peri Hagafen. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, asher kitshanu b'mitzvotav v'ratzavanu, v'shabak kodsho b'yachava u'vratzon inchilanu, zikaron l'mase v'reshit, ki hu yom techila l'mikra e'kodesh, zecher l'tziyat mitzrayim. Kivanu vacharta, viotanu kidashta, mikol hamim, vishabat kochecha, viahava uvratzon, inchaltanu, baruchata adonai, mikadesh hashabat. Amen. L'chaim. L'chaim. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam Hamotzi lechem min haaretz Amen Shabbat Shalom Yalai lalai lai Yalai lalai lai Yalai lalai lai Yalai lalai lai lai Yalai lalai lai Yalai lalai lai Yalai lalai lai Yalai lalai lai lai Yalai lalai lai Yalai lalai lai Yalai lalai lai Yalai lalai lai Shabbat Shalom Shabbat Shalom Shabbat Shalom Shabbat Shalom Shabbat Shalom everyone Shabbat Shalom